Hello and welcome to my new tutorial. Today I want to talk about attributes. So if you select an object and you click here on the object data properties and you open here the attributes panel, you can see that there are already some attributes and these are automatically generated attributes by Blender and you can add here your own attributes. So you can example given uh, rename it as you want. I want to name it H and you can uh, select the domain. This means where the value is assigned to. I want to assign it to vertex but you could also assign to edge face or face corner and you can choose your data type. In my case I want to add an integer and if I add this and if you open a spreadsheet like I did here in this panel you can see the value is added directly to all vertices. Of course, you cannot see the value on the other domain like edge, face and face corner because we added it to the vertex domain. And you can set these values very easily. Example given, you choose uh, vertices where you want to add it to. So I selected here three vertices and you go to mesh set attribute mesh set attribute and then you choose a value here. I choose seven and you see directly in the spreadsheet uh, that you set these values. I also added a geometry nodes node tree here, an empty one. And you can now read these values with the named attribute value. You choose the right value here and you choose the name. And if I now connect the viewer, you see the viewer shows exactly the same like the age, which is what you expected. And the same values could, of course, be set by the start named attribute. That's exactly the same. So if I do here the same and I store here the value 8, you will see now I have the value 8. So this means the modifier overrides your manual set values. But Blender doesn't lose anything. If I now mute this, you will see I get the manual edited values again. And if I unmute, of course, I override these. And there is another interesting note in geometry nodes. It's a remove, remove named attribute. And there you can delete that named attribute again. Of course, if I unmute, you will see again the manual entered one. And you can also remove the manual entered one by geometry nodes by remove with this attribute. I hope you learned something. Have fun. Bye.